An acorn falls from an oak tree. You know that it takes 2.5 seconds to hit the ground. How fast was it going when it hit the ground? Now, the first step is to write down our given information. So, our givens. So, the acorn falls from an oak tree. So, our initial velocity, v0, is equal to 0 meters per second. And then we also note that it takes 2.5 seconds to hit the ground. So t is equal to 2.5 seconds. Now they want to know how fast was it going when it hit the ground. So they're curious about v final. They want to know what our final velocity was. And we also know that our acceleration is equal to the acceleration due to gravity which is negative 9.8 meters per second squared. Now, we have to determine what kinematic equation to use. So our choices are V equals V naught plus AT. V squared equals V naught squared plus 2A delta X. And X equals X naught plus V naught T plus 1 half AT squared. So we see that this is the best choice, v equals v0 plus at, because we are given an initial velocity, we know the acceleration to gravity, and we have the total time, and we're trying to solve for the final velocity with which we hit the ground. So if we use the equation v equals v0 plus at, we don't have to switch anything around, because all we want to know is our final velocity. So v equals v0 is equal to 0 meters per second. Our acceleration is negative 9.8 meters per second squared. And our time is 2.5 seconds. So our final velocity is 24.5 meters per second.